Um, the other one that I think is interesting, because I do think the prospects are massive, although not everybody in the office agrees with me, is Ethiopia. Mm. Um, and I do think that Ethiopia has a number of challenges, mm. um, but it is the second most populous you know, country on the continent. Um, it has a very different history to a number of the, um, a number of the countries on the continent, and they have a very progressive leader. Um, and, and also they have their manufacturing and their, um, they actually have some very interesting industries. And actually, if you look into it, there's a lot of, there's a lot of um, US firms who are already operating there. So I think it could be a bit of a sleeping giant, but obviously there are a number of other issues that uh, I think we might need to solve as well. But for me, I think Ethiopia is very interesting. Interesting. Definitely uh, interesting. Alison? Um, I think uh, Avan has mentioned the main ones, obviously Kenya, Nigeria, South Africa. Yet we, I agree with her that no, Ethiopia is interesting just how much that's going to happen. We do not necessarily see eye to eye on. Okay. Um, I guess that's she what hasn't I was mentioned to figure out whether the debate. <laughs> she has. <laughs> um, she hasn't mentioned Ghana, which surprises me okay. from Abena, but we are seeing an awful lot of work from Ghana, whether that's because we've had a particular focus on it, but we are doing a large amount of work in Ghana at the moment. Um, and I think we should also mention the Francophone zone, obviously. I, I'm a real big advocate of that. And I think not just traditionally, we've seen it in Cote d'Ivoire, but I think Senegal is, is an upcoming player, yeah. which we should definitely be watching. Um, and in terms of North Africa, Morocco, okay. particularly Moroccan investment into sub-Saharan Africa. Yes. Um, we don't do much Moroccan work because we have some competitors that have offices there, but right. we are seeing work for Moroccan clients into sub-Saharan Africa. 